Welcome back to Amatip IT. Today we're diving into CSS Part 5, Flexbox. Flexbox is a layout model that allows you to create flexible and responsive web designs. With Flexbox, you can easily arrange and align your web elements in a way that adapts to different screen sizes. To start using Flexbox, you need to set the display property of the parent element to Flex. Flex containers have two axes, the main axis and the cross axis, which are determined by the flex direction property. You can control the placement of items along the main axis using properties like justify content and align items. Flexbox also provides the flexibility to control the size and order of individual items with the flex property. You can make an item grow or shrink according to available space using the flex grow and flex shrink properties. Flexbox introduces the concept of flex wrap, which determines whether items should wrap or stay on a single line. By default, all flex items have an equal size, but you can also modify this using the flex basis property. Flexbox makes it easy to create complex layouts that adapt gracefully to different devices and screen sizes. You can create navigation bars, grids, card layouts, and much more using the power of Flexbox. Flexbox is well supported in modern browsers, making it a reliable tool for your web design needs. In conclusion, Flexbox is a powerful tool that simplifies the process of creating flexible and responsive web layouts.